Hey guys, welcome to my channel Just Design. I am Pratik Hegde and I am back with daily UI series. I had a baby recently and my time has been happily spent with him. He is 5 months old now and I am trying to get back into rhythm with my videos. Let's see how far it goes. To watch my previous videos, you can visit the homepage of this channel. I will also put a link to my previous videos in the description below. Check it out. So today's video is a speed art for dashboard design and I have used Adobe XD to do so. One of my most favorite interface designing tool. If you have not tried it yet, I hope this video inspires you to do so. Now speaking about the topic, I have taken this since dashboard design is a frequent request these days. Businesses dream about a simple view to present all information, show trends and highlight risky areas. Basically, they want a view that will guide them into planning a bright financial future. Now, if I have to describe dashboard in one line, I would say it is an interface that organizes and presents a snapshot of information that can be easily consumed by the user to perform his intended tasks efficiently. Before starting, let me give you a context. This is a dashboard I am designing for admins sitting in the back office of specialnot.com. They are a wedding website maker. You can check out their website. I have put the link in the description below. So here I have already laid out the key areas the admin is responsible for. Like the order summary at the top which shows my yearly order. There would be the most requested features on the right hand side. And they run a referral program. so. There is like most referred by here in the middle section of the screen you can see some statistics and to the bottom of the screen you can see the upcoming weddings now since they are wedding website makers you need to know what the upcoming weddings are so this is the layout of the dashboard that i'm designing enough talk let's design designed many dashboards in my professional experience so from there I bring you four key things that you should consider while designing a good usable dashboard first know the business and its challenges now here what you do is identify what the business is about business is up to how the dashboard is going to solve their problems and what are the challenges you are trying to solve in that dashboard so you should know all these things now second is identify user groups for the dashboard. This is very important since the design we, which we are doing is eventually being used by some user. So we need to understand which users are using our dashboard. So the users can be executives, analysts, managers, supervisors and so on. 
Third, for each selected user group, you need to you need to identify KPIs. So by KPIs, what I mean is the key areas which they want to focus using this dashboard, the areas which they want to improve, the areas which they want to track or monitor using this dashboard. And lastly, select proper representation for each KPI. By representation, I mean a visualization like a chart, table, pie graph, bar graph, or just even numbers or information. There is proper logic for picking up each visualization and this particular point makes or breaks how the, how the dashboard is being used. that's all for today guys before leaving i want to know which of the dashboards you design have gone underutilized by underutilized i mean whether they have been used not up to their potential or they have been put away because they no longer work there and you can put them as comments below it would be interesting to solve and make them more usable once again, thanks for watching. If you want this channel to grow, like, share and subscribe. Take care and I will see you in the next one.